My name is Nathan Davis, and I'll be demonstrating the Galilean Cannon. Basically what it is, is it demonstrates the conservation of momentum, which is the momentum has to be conserved, it cannot be created or destroyed. So basically what it is, momentum is the product of mass and velocity. And mass is how much of an object there is, and velocity is the speed at which the object is traveling. So basically what I'm going to do is I'm going to drop this tennis ball and this basketball, and the tennis ball will be on top of the basketball. And when they hit the ground, right here, the basketball hits the ground. So the ground is going to have an equal and opposite reaction, so it's going to push up on the basketball and naturally it'll bounce. But since the tennis ball is on top of the basketball, the basketball is going to transfer its energy into the tennis ball, and the tennis ball will have the energy of the basketball and the tennis ball itself, so it's going to bounce higher than it normally would. So as you can see right here, I'll just demonstrate both of them separately. First, the basketball bounced about right here, and the tennis ball about right here, so not even close to as high. So if you do it together, and you use the conservation of momentum, <laughs> the tennis ball travels all the way over there. It would have bounced high, but it had uh, the momentum was a little off to the side. But basically, that demonstrates the conservation of momentum, and it did travel a lot further than it would have. 